Hi everyone, Lazy Fire here. Welcome back to Steam World Dig 2. We are, I, I honestly feel like, in the end game here. Uh, and I'm really excited to just keep going. Uh, and so that's what we're gonna keep doing. Oh god, I don't want to break this. I see you. Get out of here. It's been a little while since I actually uh, played the game. I uh, took a little bit of a break to do some other stuff and uh, holidays and all that stuff kind of came in and, well, you know how it goes. God, I love killing those things with the hookshot. That is a real satisfying feeling. Um, hmm. Ooh, hey. Free stuff. You know, it took me a minute to realize what that was. I haven't seen one of these things in so long. Yes, double kill. Wizard, leave me alone. I'm working on things. That is a lot of wizard. The fuck. I think I'm too far away for it to get me again. That. Oh man, that mini map with all those purple points on it, that is. that is not good for me. Get back here. I will fuck you up. I don't think he's down here, so that's good. Here he is. What up? Another one? Where's this guy? Oh. Oh my. Dude survived that shit. Must be more hardcore than I gave him credit for. Okay, so we're gonna leave those alone because I get the feeling that I'm going to be able to get those at some point in the near future. Oh, you know what? I have. There we go, yeah. I have the magnet there. Quite annoying. There. Uh, should do it for this area, I think. Oh, I was super not paying attention. I'm actually getting a call at the moment. I'm leaving it. I'm gonna let it go to voicemail because it's definitely a spam caller, but you know. There's distractions. It's important that you know. I have distractions. Alright, bro. Come on. Come on. Figure it out. The grappling hook is fantastic, isn't it? Like, I know how great the, uh, the jetpack is by all accounts, but man, that grappling hook has got a lot of uses. Once you can kind of master the fact that it switches enemies around when they're about to attack, that is really where it starts to make a difference, I feel. Um, come on down. Oh, or, or occasionally you just forget how grappling hooks work. Oh, come here. That's a fake wall. See ya. Um, the hell? So I don't know what just happened there, but I'm going back down after I kill this guy. Hmm. Or... This is some fucking Mario World 2 bullshit. Cross. I have to go up to the cave and over to go kill that guy. So what is going to happen? Or oh, wait. Oh. Mm. All right. I mean, I know Portal of Pardon, but. 
it's right here. I need to come up this way anyways. Don't feel so bad about it. That's a hall. Should I get the backpack? No, 2000. Yeah, I gotta go back down one more time. One last score. Let's go fuck up that fucking wizard. Get out of here. Oh, come on. What the hell? I don't remember doing that, but sure. I really do like that magnet ability. Any game where you're like collecting stuff like this one and having a magnet ability is just really interesting. Now I'm gonna go fuck up this one. Oh, why are there two of you? Hey. That was pretty slick, I gotta say. If you don't know what's happened there, I, uh, neither do I, but I think what happened was, uh, I definitely jetpacked one and then popped the other. Just one. Yeah, I think that's what happened. Based on what we just saw there. Is there some sort of goddamn Hogwarts down here? Come here. Perfect. Ooh, there's a lot more down there. Let's go down there. Cool. And then one across the way. And then another uh, exit. I mean, I'm sure, like, some sort of wizard labor rights group is gonna have my ass over this, but it's a really effective way to do it. Did he just murder himself? Yeah. Oh, wow. That was frustrating. Oh, dude. Gotta talk about that. He was in a really difficult to hit spot. There. Hey, check it out. That was a lot of beating I just took, and only two hearts down, so that new armor is really paying off. A lot of secrets in this area. Hey, a cock. Excellent. That's good news. So I definitely want to put more cog upgrades on before I uh, go into any sort of final battle I may find myself in. Yeah, this 
looks pretty inner sanctum. -y. I'm gonna grab, yeah, I'm gonna grab this stuff and just lava hop my way out of it. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh, boy. Uh, a little bit too much confidence in my abilities right there. So, yes, we're very close to whatever the inner sanctum will be. Yes, we are there. Guess what? I need an upgrade. Perfect. Oh, why'd I do that? I have one left. Fuck it. I wasn't gonna go put that other one back on, that's for goddamn sure. Alright. Let's see what new obstacle we have in front of us. You know, there is a way to beat this game without the jetpack from what I've read. And it looks something like this. Oh, yeah. Uh, well, I'm going to stop trying to do that because I clearly am not the person who's going to be this guy with the jetpack. Oh, this looks ominous. This looks like endgame to me. another 10 hours to this game, I give up. Like someone else gets to do this LP. No, I'm joking. I'd actually really appreciate another 10 hours of game. Oh yeah. I basically can fly forever now. Oh, oh no. The hovering horror. Get out of here. I'm on a mission. I'm sure this isn't frustrating for anybody. Oh my god. Oh, it goes down so quickly. I am really glad I did this. Get out of here. No one likes you. Why am I back here? I don't know. Oh, you know what? I did want to do one thing. See, the golem altar here. I didn't open all of this as far as I recall. Knock 
ripped open that thing and we had the other one on the other side. This is, I am sure, not frustrating. Uh, alright. Maybe I'm too dumb to remember this. Right? There was like a whole thing here that I missed. Got everything. I thought there was like a switch thing that I was doing. Did I just forget that. Just really prepared for like a video. Maybe that would help things. Find anything? Okay. Going through the fucking lava tripper hall. Let's just go see Rosie. Maybe I'll just remember something. Else. Hmm. Yeah, no. Let's go. Let's go check. I'm probably gonna get to go through that giant door. Hey, I know how to do it. I found it that other time. Yeah, this place. The place that I thought was a throwback to the previous game because I hadn't seen those bugs in a while. Yeah, fuck. Two seconds of work. Not bad. Uh, yep, didn't need water. Whatever. Just a quick check to see if I missed anything important. So. making sure that all the uh, all the blocks in the area have been checked. Oh, that was a loading screen. So, I know that this won't work. What if? No. Like, there's a part of me that's just like, oh, there's, there's an entrance. It's two feet away. Come on. No? Okay, fine. That's fine, too. Where's my nearest back to? This way's up. Or down. Down. Oh, the birds. Get fucked. Actually, this is a really good opportunity to just check stuff out. I might have missed something or other in here. Never mind. Like, there's one ore. It's worth six dollars. Not exactly good money. I'll take it. Okay, excellent, good. Yeah, 
glass over here. No? Thought I heard a cog for a moment. going to naturally be like two feet away. I just have to jetpack my way through something. My assumption is. come to believe that it's not there. It might be further down. Let's see. Let's see the uh yeah I see now. That green segment down there is where I want to go. idea how you do this segment without the jetpack. I guess you'd have to like manipulate the uh, falling of the acid. Shut up. Cool. May have just busted through that a little faster than expected, but I'll take it. And neat, this pipe is finally I really hope that I was just always too stupid to figure that out. Oh, that's a bomb. have to go through that angle. That's fine. Shortcut. Yeah, I'm gonna power through this. There we go. There we go. Yeah, everything's fine. I guess it's one of those secrets. Put that in quotation marks, secrets. Um, that you just have to figure it out. Uh, how do you? Breaking my brain. There's got to be a way to do that, though. We're fine. It's 
a half heart. That's all it took. Can't use the jackhammer. Anymore. The hell? How the fuck was I supposed to figure that out? That's good to know. getting hurt. Ha! Ah, neat. Okay. Figured that out myself. Definitely didn't need help. Almost went through a door I've gone through a hundred times instead of the big scary door that I've been trying to go through all game. I'm sure that's like the point of no return, but honestly, I've picked up uh, two cogs and I probably could put an upgrade on, but I'm not going to, so we're gonna do this. Look at all of those health and flame and water. I don't need Take this, Rusty. Okay. Bad. Oh no, bullet hell. I'm fucked. So 
that's not working. Now we're playing Breakout. This is just getting worse and worse for me. Like, let's find more games I'm terrible at. Oh, good, and the level's rising, and there's birds. This is not, this is not gonna work for me, is it? Hey, bird, bird. I'm gonna get made so much fun of in the thread. Well, that bird just murdered itself. God damn it. There's no way this works. Oh, it got worse. Now I'm stuck inside a bird. Okay. Huh. Nope. Nope. There's like anything you can do. No, probably not. Okay. Goddamn second stage. with Rusty. Can't jump. Can't grappling hook. Sure was a fight. gonna go sacrifice himself, which is kind of nice. It's New World Dig 3. Search for Fen. Although I think I know where this is going.
do know about Steambot Heist is that it does take place in space, so I kind of now assume that this is uh, something of a prequel to that. Based on the rocket going to space and the planet exploding, I don't think the planet exploded. Yeah, I guess they have to go to space. So uh, Steam World Dig 3 will take place on like fucking Mars or some shit. Uh, maybe. Who knows? Maybe there's no more Steam World Dig. Um, really fun game like there's a lot to it and there's things I missed I fully recognize that fact um, oh yeah, I guess they're robots the whole being in space thing wouldn't be as terrible as it might have been ooh maybe in the next Steam World game you use your uh, jetpack to go between the rocks that used to be the planet who knows um, but yeah like the uh the game in and of itself is just really fun, really well, uh, well plotted, well planned. You get from one area to the next pretty easily. It all feels really good. Um, I really can't complain about any real part of this game outside of uh, just me being terrible. I mean, some of those secrets uh, that we went back and found were uh, pretty difficult to find, and on your own, you're probably not going to find them. And some of the puzzles that I completed at the end there, you definitely, I felt like, just, even with all the weird techniques and skills and everything that you can put together in this game, I could not figure a way to do it out without certain cog upgrades. And that's probably why you can switch them on and off in a lot of ways. Uh, it makes sense that you know, you'd be able to go back and just go, okay, well, I need to have this cog upgrade or this cog upgrade because I need to get through this thing. Makes sense. Um, but yeah, otherwise, just a really fun game. Really good time. I'm really glad I went back and did this. And, you know, it's one of those things, I bought it. <laughs> Noise acting. Uh, it's one of those things that where I, I bought I bought it a while ago and always intended to do something with it, either play it or uh, LP it like this, and I just got into my head, it was, you know, good time to do this, and nice change of pace for a lot of the stuff I play anyways, a lot of shooters and everything, and this is just a nice, you know, fun romp, it, nothing wrong with anything here, it's really good, and uh, I, I enjoyed it. I don't know if that's been absolutely clear at all times, but definitely made my case that it is a really fun game, and if you have an interest in, you know, just a fun platformer with uh, some light puzzle elements, this is really going to hit your sweet spot. I, I'm just waiting to see if there's a post credit scene. I don't think there is, but who knows. But yeah, yeah, go pick it up. Play it. Office Dogs. One of those things I always get really... Man, a Caesar and a Kaiser. Huh. Um, I, I really wish my office would allow dogs. There's days where the area I'm in, I could totally bring my dog in. No one would notice. It would be really fun. 
Um, the dog would get a kick out of that as long as I brought like a bed or something for her. But I don't think I'd get her past security. Um, it's just too bad. It's like the, the area where my office is in the building is actually... It has an external access. It used to be the security office for the warehouse area. Um, and they converted it to office space. And so it has its own access areas. Like, I still have to go past the security guard, but if I could sneak the dog in somehow, I don't know. Three deaths. Got money, though. Got most of the secrets. 10 hours, 31 minutes is a bad time, apparently, but whatever, I fucked around a lot. Not bad. Excellent. Well, thanks for watching, everyone. I'll see you in uh, whatever I might do next. Bye.